hello friends welcome back and in this tutorial i'm going to show you how to achieve this very cool looking blog like effect with all these shadows and like these paper elements and maybe some of you can see these gray shadows in between and all these cool things without writing kind of not much lines of code and that too with polymer totally so let's hop into the code directly so actually i had gone ahead and pasted some code so i'll just remove that just remove all of it and also remove all this part okay so so now if we go into the code and let the browser to refresh okay so now we are basically where we had uh, left the last time and let me just remove the css out here too just comment out the CSS and okay so this is basically where we had left out the last time and I've just uh, added one header to the fold uh, to the page and maybe most of you would be knowing how to do this and in case you don't know so just check out any of the sites like uh, like two three schools or something like that where they will show you how to write this so because it's actually very easy and you just just have to write this h1 tag and write your heading between in between those h1 tags so to achieve this cool looking paper like effect you have to actually go ahead and add one of the polymer elements to it and that is this paper material so this paper material is actually what is responsible for these cool looking shadows and all okay so to add it you have to first add it in your elements file so I so this one would be somewhere like here I will just search for it control F okay so this one is out here this paper material I have already added in this HTML file and now in this YouTube element uh, YouTube element page we'll just put the google youtube tag in between these paper elements so just put it out here and now we'll achieve this effect so basically we had a lot of those together so maybe just copy paste this code and i'll just copy this and paste it a bunch of times just like this okay so after copy pasting if you just let this re to reload okay so after reloading we can see that all these elements are kind of stacked up once one again one against each other but we do have these cool looking paper shadows which are actually part of this the google material design so maybe in the next tutorial i'll teach you how to just separate out these elements maybe most of you would be knowing how to do it, do this with css but just in case for those who don't know i'll just put in some margin and show you how to put that those tags and all so so you can achieve any blog like looking effect for your blogs or something like that very easily so please subscribe to the channel and definitely thank